Xbox VR could be a thing soon, and so Microsoft gives us some in-depth details. So let's talk about it right now. Let's get it. Microsoft acquires Activision Blizzard for $69 billion to play a key role. Right here is where we feel Xbox VR is going to make a leap in metaverse development. So this is huge because Xbox VR could definitely be something or just we don't know how soon. That's the thing. PSVR, it could be to combat PSVR. Microsoft announced it's planning to acquire Activision Blizzard 68.7 billion, making it the largest gaming acquisition to date. Microsoft CEO Nadella says the studio will play a key role in development of its future metaverse platforms. AR, is it VR? Is it far more of an XR approach? We don't know, mixed reality type glasses, <laughs> whatever it is they're up to, I'm sure it's gonna be huge what they're up to. So Microsoft seems to be gradually absorbing some of gaming's most influential companies in an apparent bid to solidify its position in a market that's rapidly changing focus on immersion between virtual worlds, what some have dubbed the metaverse. Hey, yeah, you know we like the metaverse right here, and I believe it has to do with their cloud gaming, so let's keep reading on it. I want to read this other one because we got some more metaverse news right here, so... Like with Meta, formerly Facebook plans to create its version of the Metaverse have remained fairly nebulous par for the course, I mean, since the Metaverse was co-opted. A summation of virtual worlds or a monolithic virtual platform, Metaverse with a capital M, it seems Microsoft is speaking about supporting any metaverse in a much broader sense here. So let's check it out. Gaming is the most dynamic and exciting category in entertainment across all platforms today and will play a key role in the development of metaverse platforms, said Microsoft CEO. When we think about our vision for what a metaverse can be, we believe there won't be a single centralized metaverse. It shouldn't be. We need to support many metaverse platforms as well as a robust ecosystem of content, commerce, and applications. This is huge because they already had made it clear that they're not trying to be a massive competition with PlayStation. That although they are different companies, they're trying to find a way to just really gather in and tell and be able to try to work and collab a lot more often versus just exclusivity. And then especially with the with the with the with the purchase of this also now they're mentioning that they don't think it should be all these these separate things it should just be more of a broad sense and that it could be um just a massive ecosystem where people can go in and out of the metaverse which is awesome too so xbox is looking into vr heavily heavily right now uh, Microsoft uh, has lagged far be, uh, behind competitors Sony and Meta, both of which have developed their own VR gaming ecosystems and platform exclusive hardware. Xbox doesn't feature any form of official VR compatibility, even with its range of Microsoft's mixed reality headsets. Um, still, he says that he wants Xbox Metaverse strategy to extend to all any screen that can render those games. I want to be able to experience the things I own on any screen that can render those, which is goes into the cloud gaming component that they have. And he says, I want to have them. So right here, it says a lot of cloud infrastructure to make that happen. Um, an open approach. So an open approach, uh, going to give them that inside of VR. It appears that Spencer is very much ingrained in traditional platforms when he talks about any screen. However, the Xbox chief says developing VR hardware is still not a main focus. I applaud what Sony's doing. I applaud what Oculus is doing, what Valve has done. Spencer said during Wall Street's Journal uh, Tech Live event. They're forefronting. So overall, all in all, is Xbox VR going to happen maybe next year? Probably not. But them wanted to be a part of the metaverse through cloud gaming. Basically, they want their platform to be able to be played anywhere since the cloud gaming is able to be played on tablets, on laptops, on phones. Now they want to have it. They have an approach to possibly. So there's two options. Either Xbox has their own type of ecosystem or Xbox virtual reality kind of has their own headset or Xbox just collabs with Meta because they're possibly not going to collab with their ultimate competitor, PlayStation, even though they call it cool with the whole Activision thing. I believe there could be an Xbox Meta collaboration, and I, and I feel that's exactly what's going to happen. Xbox actually trying to have some form of an app, a VR app, or maybe some, or maybe like a beta app. We can get into at least some AR and get into some the fluctuation of things to get rolling. So let me know what's up. Y'all hit us over the thumbs up to subscribe. It really does mean the world. Peace.